Hello, hello. Hi, how are you? I am here, yay. Okay, welcome, welcome, Edgar, welcome, Gabby. Hi, good evening. Hello, good evening. I'm going to turn it on. It's a light. Hey. hey. <laughs> Hello, Nidia. Welcome. How are you, my dear students? I'm pretty good. How about you? I'm doing great. Very, very happy to, to have all of you here, to see you, to enjoy another day with all of you. I'm so glad to hear that. Yes. Well, I am going to uh, give a couple of seconds to all of your friends to connect and we are going to start working. We have many things to do today. And among those things that we need to do is uh, we need to check on your progress in the platform. And we also need to check about the document if you have already sent it or not, but I am going to do that right now. So, because we have many announcements from Inglés Corporativo that they have been checking on you to see if you have advanced on the grades, on the different uh, activities, right? So we are going to check that. Let me open my attendance and we will start. Let's see. Okay. Hmm. Welcome to all the ones that have just connected. Here we are. Well, let me share my screen, my dear class, with all of you. Yeah, all the other ones are sleeping today. Hoy solo nueve han despertado. De todos como 28 que son. Me va a regañar la teacher por la plataforma. <laughs> That's why they are not here. I will send a message to them. Uh, but thank you for the for the messages there. Thank you, Stanley, for the messages. That's so beautiful. Happy International Good evening, the welcome. Hi. Happy International Happy. Women's Day to all of you here in mm -hmm. the class, in, to your mothers, your sisters, all the women in your life. You know, today is a very curious day because uh, okay, Carlita. Carlita, send me the... Okay, you have problems with the exercise 3.6. We are going to check them right now. Don't worry. What happened with the exercise? Let me see. Okay. The International Women's Day, it's a day to commemorate all women. And for sure, I think it's every single day, right? Not only today. But it is to commemorate their effort, their... Uh, passion to work, the passion to live and everything. So I think I have very, very hard worker ladies in this class. So happy day for all of you. Wonder Woman. Yeah, we have a lot of Wonder Womans here. That's a Wonder Woman. Thank you, teacher. So I will open the platform in a second, okay? Ya estoy ahí en la plataforma para que le podamos ayudar a Carlita. What is the problem, Carlita, with the with the exercise? The croquet teacher, the the exercise, the celebrity celebrity, the Brazil. Uh huh. The audio. Sí, el audio. Okay. Yeah, I think it it has been giving problems since the last group. For me, for me in my case, uh. uh ¿Cómo se dice? How do you say? Fue bien difícil. It was difficult. It was it was difficult. And, and finally, uh, uh, we solved the the part. You, the, you solved the exercises. Exactly. 
Okay. Yeah, I, we're going to check what is the problem. I think it's the, the problem is that it doesn't the audio doesn't work. So I think that is the, the issue with that exercise. But we're going to start with something different today. I am going to go over each of you. I am going to go one by one asking you about the platform and about the document. Okay. Hoy recibimos varios eh, varios anuncios de parte de Inglés Corporativo acerca de cosas importantes que tenemos que finalizar. Así que las vamos a revisar, vamos a irnos uno por uno, les voy a ir consultando a cada uno y este, ustedes me van dando ahí su, su update de cómo vamos, ¿ok? Alejandra Beatriz. Hi. Hello, Alejandra. Eh, did you, what is your advancement on the platform and if you have sent the document or not? And if you sign up for the next module. Son las tres preguntas. What is your advancement on the platform? Did you send the document or not? And did you send the information for the next module? And um, I have sent the document. And um, I... <laughs> Hi, um, I'm ready to begin. I want you to follow me and repeat the words. As the <laughs> okay. <laughs> and and I'm not advancing the in the modules, but I'm going to uh, um add, uh, con I no sé, pero no, voy don't a worry, don't worry. Okay. Uh, ¿En qué en qué parte de la plataforma va? Um, me falta el Okay. Uh, remember that you need to finish that for tomorrow. We are going to work on that after this. Okay. Después de que les pase esta pequeña como revisión a todos, vamos a irnos a la plataforma para terminarla. Okay. Para que vean ustedes los ejercicios que tal vez les están dando problemas y los podemos completar. Okay. So please, let's do this. Recuerden que son tres cosas. La plataforma cómo vamos avanzando, el documento si ya lo enviamos y la inscripción para el siguiente módulo, para su intermedio 3. Yo creo que ya lo recibieron ahora, ¿verdad? Yes, teacher. Ok, so please, that's very important that you fill it up, ok, para que le guarden el cupo para el próximo módulo. Ya vamos más para allá que para acá, así que nadie tira la toalla ahorita. <ríe> Let's see, Ángel Alejandro. Hello, teacher. Hello. What is your advancement uh, on the platform? Um, the platform is not finished. Uh, it's not yet finished, but today I finish it. And the documents will be sent tomorrow and also uh, made to subscribe. Okay, the form to subscribe. <laughs> to sign up in that case. To sign up. Porque ya no se, ya no se inscriben. Cuando es por primera vez, si podemos decir subscribe. But if you are going to continue, you say to sign up para inscribirse. Okay, thank you. So please send the documents. Tan pronto los mande, eh, me confirma, porfa, este ángel. Me dice, okay, teacher, ya see. enviados y terminados. Ceci de Los Ángeles. Yes, eh, tomorrow I am going to send the document and the new assignment. Uh -huh. And uh, today I am going to finish the the platform, okay. eh, the, the section three. Section three and the midterm exams, okay? Yes. Section three and the midterm exams. Good, okay. very good. Let's continue with uh, Cesar Guadalupe. Tell me. Cesar, what is your yes, advancement on the platform? On the platform, I almost finished that, but I have problems. You have problems with? With what? Uy, perdí a Cesar. Oh, ya, 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 ya lo recuperaré. Tan pronto lo recupere, me sigue contando. Oh, I'm, you are there. <laughs> Cesar, I can listen the audio, teacher. You, okay, we're going to check that. Okay, we're going to check that right now. Edgar Abel. Ah, sorry. Cesar, did you send the document? Uh, yes. Okay. ¿Y el, la inscripción para el siguiente módulo? Not, not, 
but mm, tomorrow. Okay, please let me know as soon as you finish. Edgar? Okay. I'm tell here. Me, tell me about your advancement on the platform, the document, uh, and I'm, the next I'm, module. I'm done with my platform and I send my document. And for the next level, I, I, I need to fill it up to sign okay. up that. Very good. Thank you very much. As soon as you do it, let me know. Okay. Edson, tell me. Okay, uh, for me, teacher, I I have already finished the section three, and I am studying starting the meter exam. Okay. And today I send the manual document, and in these days I send the document for the next model. Okay, good, very good. So let me know as soon as you do it. Okay, the manual. It's tomorrow. It's the last day. Okay, para el documento del manual, mañana es el último día, así que porfa, no lo dejen para el viernes porque ya no se lo van a recibir. Eduardo José, tell me. What is your advancement on the platform, Eduardito? No, he's not here right now. Okay, Eduardito, se me ha perdido. Elvira? I think Elvira was on the chat. Let me see. Uh, sorry, I can only listen. Okay, Elvira, if you can send me the answer on the chat, that would be perfect, please. About the platform, the document, and the sign up for the next module. Ever Ernesto. Hello, teacher. Hi, tell me, what is your advancement on the platform? I have to do the lesson three and the midterm exam. And okay. I have to upload the description. Uh -huh. and the book okay please I need you to do that as soon as possible because it is necessary for you to finish with that okay let me know as soon as you do it okay okay thank you Gabriela Michelle um, I already finished the, the unit 3 in the midterm and the document I sent it in the evening I think uh -huh. And um, the the other document, I I'm, I'm going to send it tomorrow. Okay, perfect. Let me know as soon as you do it. Okay. Isabel, tell me about the advancement on the platform, the document, and the next module. And the document uh, of the manual, I'm going to send today. Okay. And the next module tomorrow and the platform and the section tonight okay the section three and the midterm tonight jenny yes. elizabeth jenny 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 i think jenny is not connected yet joanna Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. Good Tell evening. me about your advancement on the platform, the document, and the next module. The platform, I did uh, 3.6. Okay. Uh, the docu the manual document I sent today. Okay, please do it and let me know when you finish doing that, okay? And yes, Jose the Daniel, uh -huh, and the inscription for the next one? I'm going to send tomorrow. Okay, perfect. I will be dependent of that, okay? Jose Daniel, tell me. Jose Daniel. I cannot see Jose Daniel. Where are you? Uy, he's not here right now. Carla Fabiola? Oh, Carlita is on the chat. So please confirm, Carlita. I am going to help you in a moment with the exercise. Katherine Alejandra? Catherine, Catherine, no está Catherine. Miguel Ángel, anda vagando con Catherine. Nidia, anda vagando con Miguel. Nah. No, <laughs> tell me, Nidia, what is your advancement on the platform? Es, the exercise, es, okay, the advanced platform, eh, me. 
me falta, ¿cómo se dice? Me falta I am una actividad. Ay, me dicen, I want activity. De, se dicen de, de carnaval. Uh -huh. I don't understand. Ok. Y al uh, y, uh, meeting, y un one activity, two. Ok. En el manual, eh, saying yesterday. Y el, uh, el otro de la inscripción. Uh -huh. eh, más noche lo voy a hacer. Later, later on. Later, later no, ya, okay. aquí tengo ya, ya impresa la hoja. Perfect, <laughs> perfect. Let's see, Mr. Raúl. He's not here today. Anda paseando Mr. Raúl, con Miguel anda. Ok, good. Fueron de parranda. Ah, se fueron de parranda. Reina Elizabeth. Ajá, Reina también se me fue a apagar. Nombre si la acabo de ver conectada. Reineta. Ok. Se fue a vagar con Don Miguel. Eh, Ruth, Elizabeth. Eh, for my the manual document, I sent tonight eh, the, the other documents, maybe tomorrow, because I had problems with my surgery. Oh, yeah, 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 I don't. Hi. And, the, and the platform? And the platform I had working this afternoon in the section three. Maybe two later I finish. Okay, very good. Let me know, please. Tan pronto termine me avisa. Okay. Uh, Elizabeth, hi. Ya la vi, conectada. <laughs> Elizabeth, what, have you advanced on the platform? Reina Elizabeth? Ooh. Well, if you can answer later, please tell me. Samuel Isaac? Hi, teacher. Okay, tell me about your advancement on the platform. Sí, he tratado de avanzar, pero este, se me ha hecho difícil porque me puse al corriente el día martes, porque como tuve una cirugía, estuve bastante malo pero yeah. me de avanzar y el documento si no lo he mandado mañana voy a mandar el documento del, del manual y porque un familiar me va a hacer el favor de sacármelo y, y yo lo voy, a, lo, lo voy a tomar lo voy a escanear lo voy a mandar los documentos también para la nueva inscripción okay. tengo problemas con el ejercicio 3.6 de la <risa> ok de la Ahora, ahorita lo vamos a ver ahorita lo vamos a ver entre todos aquí okay. don't worry Okay, good. Thank you very much. Jenny, welcome. Thank you, teacher. I'm sorry. I I um, was late for my job. Don't worry, don't worry. But you are here. Jenny, have you advanced on the platform? Yeah, but just um, unit uh, three. Okay. Um, I need to complete the um, Mid, mid exam mid term the mid -term? I, I don't remember the the number the the name okay good so please uh, well as soon as you finish let me know okay i am missing okay. in the document did you send the document yeah yeah i sent the document uh, last thursday okay perfect excellent thank you jenny sandra leticia hi teacher uh, I sent the document the last week. Okay. And from the advance in the platform is 50%. Okay. And the inscription, inscription tomorrow, teacher. Okay, you will do your inscription tomorrow. Perfect. And what about Gen C? Hello, teacher. Hello. Hello. I am going to go section two. Uh -huh. I have finished section one and two, and I haven't sent the document I am going to do tomorrow, and the online registration I will to do it later. Okay, you will do it later, okay? Perfect. So, please, to all the ones that are pendant with anything, a los que le falte cualquiera de los documentos, eh, please let me know as soon as you send it or as soon as you finish, okay? Tan pronto lo terminen, avisen. Let me just try this one. Okay. So, in this one, I am going to show you here. 
here, here, here. Let me share my screen with all of you. Le voy a compartir mi pantalla para que podamos ver lo de la plataforma. And here I go. Okay. So this is section number three, right? This is section number three. And this is the exercise that you say that you have problems with. Let me just check it, okay? Let me check what is the problem here. That is a little difficult. Okay, here you go. And it says, listen to the audio and answer the following questions. Type full answers. For question number two, type the number in letters, it says. So let's listen to the audio. There you go. Exercise five, listening. Carnival time. Part A. Mike has just returned from Brazil. Listen to him talk about Carnival. What did he enjoy most about it? Isn't that music fantastic? It's from a samba CD that I got when I was in Rio for Carnival. Wow, Carnival in Rio is really something. It's a party that lasts for four whole days. It's held in late February or early March, but you need to book a hotel room way in advance. Okay, what is a carnival, people? He just mentioned it. A carnival is a party. And you have options here for you to complete it. A carnival, what is a carnival? It is a party, period, yeah. right? Party, period, party with mayuscula, carnival is a party. All those answers are possible, right? It is a party. This is okay. the answer that we are looking for, right? What is a carnival? It is a party, right? Carnival is a party. Right? That is it's... And if you only write party, it's correct, right? And si, si pusieron solamente party con punto, it's correct as well. Let's continue here. Let's continue listening. Because hotels fill up really quickly. Carnival is celebrated all over Brazil, but the most famous party is in Rio. The whole city is decorated with colored lights and streamers. It's really beautiful. Everyone is very friendly, especially to visitors from other countries. The best part about Carnival is the big parade. The costumes are unbelievable. People work on them for months. It's really fantastic to watch. Everyone dances the samba in the streets. I'd really recommend you go to Rio for Carnival if you ever have the chance. Okay. Page 52, exercise five. In this case, how long is it? Is the carnival? You listen to it before and it says like, it is a party that is celebrated for four days, right? Four whole days, it lasts four days. Or if you only write four days, it's correct, right? You can write here four days. And the next, the next one, it says, when is it? When is the carnival? And he here, for sure, we're going to keep on listening here. Part B. Listen again and answer these questions. Listen for the answer. Isn't that music fantastic? It's from a samba CD that I got when I was in Rio for Carnival. Wow, Carnival in Rio is really something. It's a party that lasts for four whole days. It's held in late February or early March. But you need to book a hotel room way in advance because hotels fill up really quickly. Carnival is celebrated all over Brazil, but the most famous party is in Rio. The whole city is decorated with colored lights and streamers. It's really beautiful. Everyone is very friendly, especially to visitors from other countries. The best part about Carnival is the big parade. The costumes are unbelievable. People work on them for months. It's really fantastic to watch. Everyone dances the samba in the streets. I'd really recommend you go to Rio for Carnival if you ever have the chance. Okay, so the samba is a dance, right? The samba is a dance. And those are the forms of answer, right? It is on late February. I think I move it here. Sorry, I'm missing the period. Yep, ah, what happened here? <laughs> I have traveled with that, but I finally I answered. 
let's see if I say only this one. No. And I took it from the answers. Ironic. Or early uh, March. It's early March, right? Here we have all the options, right? Aquí tienen todas las opciones. And I got it from the platform and you see it's not working. Let's see. Huh, it didn't get it. It's a, it, it's on late February or March or early March. Okay. Let's see. I am going to erase theirs. The idea is that you can write it. It's early March. <laughs> and I'm getting it from the answers, okay? Aquí es donde les pruebo que la plataforma también les puede dar problemas porque lo agarramos de la plataforma y no funciona. I think it's the complete thing here. There you go. Yay. <laughs> it's the complete thing. It's on late February or early March. Okay, tenemos que ponerlo completa porque si no, no lo va a agarrar. It's on late February or early March. Four days and it's a party. Okay, so Carlita, there you have the answers for your exercise. Exercise 3.6. On the first one that we had here, it was uh, multiple choice, right? Yesterday, we were talking about this, that we were going to start working with holidays and festivals, right? New Year's Day is a day when? What do you do in New Year's Day? People have parties with family and friends. People have, People have parties. parties with families and friends. People have parties with families and friends. April's full day. What is it? People sometimes... Play People tricks on friends. Sometimes play tricks on friends. You know what is the meaning of tricks? Bromas. Travesuras. Travesuras or bromas, right? Tricks. That's April's full. The next one. May and June are the months when? Many young adults chose to get married. Many young adults choose to get married, right? Valentine's Day is a day when? People express their love to someone. People express their love. Labor Day is a day when? People in many countries honor workers. People in many countries honor workers. February is the month when? Brazilians celebrate carnival. Brazilians celebrate carnival. Bar Brazilians celebrate the carnival. Very good job. So we continue here on the next exercise that we had for section number three, right? We had two more here. We have in the knowledge check, this is a multiple choice. Before a man and a woman get married, they usually date each other for about a year. <laughs> for about a year, not 10 years, okay? Or 20. <laughs> Aquí en El Salvador, media vida de novios y media vida casada. <laughs> 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 so get married soon okay don't worry the next one when a couple gets engaged they the man often gives the woman a diamond ring gives the woman a diamond ring right a ring is enough if it is a diamond or not yeah <laughs> right after a couple gets engaged they usually begin, begin to plan the wedding ready. Begin to plan the wedding. Very good. When a woman gets married, her family usually pays for the wedding and reception. Pays for the wedding and reception. You know, uh, I met friends from different cultures uh, last year. And they say that in some cultures, you have to receive animals, money, cows in order for you to get married, right? Había una amiga que tenía que dar no sé cuántas vacas o no sé cuántas cabezas de ganado para poderse casar. And I was like, mm -hmm. I did it for free, I said. <laughs> so, uh, in the other one, uh, there was the amount of money of the parents of the boy. The, it was like kind of a quantity for the girl's family. Right. Si la fortuna de Edgar Abel, por ejemplo, ascendía a 300 mil dólares, tenía que darle como 20 mil a la familia, a la novia. And I was like, 
<laughs> okay. A mí me dieron un champú, dije. <laughs> like in Shrek. So, that's what they do in other cultures. When people are invited to a wedding, they almost always... Give the bride a groom a gift of some money. money. They give a gift or some money. Right after the couple gets married, they usually go on a short trip called a honeymoon. Go on a short trip called honeymoon. Very good. Excellent. So that was the other exercise. It is about choosing only, okay? And the last one, if I am not mistaken, it's a reading. Unique customs, right? In this case, I am going to do something extra, extra with the reading, but I am going to check on the answers, right? What is the meaning of them in paragraph one? Let's go here. What is the meaning of them in paragraph one? And it's yes, them. It's in yeah? plural for, for they. Okay, it is the plural for them. Okay, but... Is it for people, for animals, or protection? Animals. It says, January 17 in San Antonio's Day in Mexico is a day when people ask for protection for their animals by bringing them to church. Este them, de aquí, a quien se refiere? To the animals, right? Animals. Protection for their animals by bringing them, right? So in this case, it is referred to the animals. What is the meaning of it in paragraph two? Let's go and check. Paragraph number two, and it says, on August 15 of the lunar calendar, Koreans celebrate Shusok, also known as Korean Thanksgiving. It's a day when people give thanks to the harbors. Korean families honor their ancestors by going on their graves to take them rice and fruit and to clean their graveyards. So in this case, it, in paragraph two, line two, it's a day. Shusok. 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 You are referring to Shusok, right? It is a day. You are talking about the celebration. What is the meaning of there in paragraph two, line four? And here I go. Paragraph two, line number four. It says, Korean families honor their ancestors by going to their graves to take them rice and fruit and clean their graveyards. It is referred Korean, to... Korean families. Are you sure? Yes, I am. Yes. <laughs> it Korean says, families. in this case, to take them rice and, full and fruit and clean the grave sites. They are referring to the Korean families. What about number four? What is the meaning of them in paragraph three? Chan, chan, chan. Here we go. Long ago in India, a princess who needed help sent her silk bracelet to an emperor. Although he did not arrive in time to help her, he kept the bracelet as, as a sign of the bond between them. Mem. It is talking about a Man. paragraph uh, three, line number five. In this case, them, right? We have line number five. One, two, three, four, five. And it says, today in India, during the festival of Raki, men promise to be loyal to their women. In exchange, the woman give them, so a bracelet of silk. In this case, them, this one, refers to the men, as you were saying. Very good. And the last one, this, paragraph four, line four. Let's go here. One of the biggest celebrations in Argentina is New Year's Eve. On the evening of December 31st, families get together and have a big meal. At midnight, fireworks explode everywhere and continue throughout the night. This is a day when friends and family meet for parties, which lasts until the next morning. What is the meaning of this in this New paragraph? New Year's Eve. New Year's Eve, right? And the last one, what is the meaning of them in paragraph five, line five? Let's see. 
One, two, three, four, five. After they throw the beans, they pick them up and eat one bean for each year of their age. They pick them up. What does it refer to? It refers to beans. the beans. beans. To the beans, right? Very good. So that was the exercises for section number three. So what is the only thing that we are missing, people? If you finish all this, the only thing that you are missing is the midterm exams. We have five exams. In this one, we are going to choose the different words for us to complete. And it says, please clean off, up, or on. Up. Clean up your bedroom. It's a, it's really a mess. Could you please put the groceries in the away. kitchen? Put away, put away. Put away put the up. groceries. Can you turn the TV while I am on the phone? Turn down. Turn okay. down. Turn down the TV, right? And the next one. Microwave uh, ovens yes. are used for cooking. For, for cooking. cooking. Okay, I are used for cooking food very fast. When you go to the beach, try not to get not to get not to get, start. right? We were explaining this yesterday that we don't say to don't. You say not to get, right? It's you a, can use, yes? I'm sorry, excuse me. Uh, what is the meaning camcorder? The camcorder is la cámara de video. Okay. The camcorder. As we don't use them anymore, right? It's not vocabulary that we normally use nowadays, right? The camcorder. Esa la, eran como las videocámaras, la grandota. <laughs> when you use my cell phone, Oh, sorry. You can use my cell phone. To leave a voicemail. To leave a voicemail. Very good. Don't forget. To take. Don't forget to take. To right. Take. Don't forget to take your ATM, ATM card, card with, with you. you. Very good. So that was the first evaluation. What about the next one? In this one, you have to rewrite. These are kind of the most difficult because you need to type and you need to do it right in order to take advantage of the time we're going to show the answers right vamos a revisar solo las respuestas para que las puedan quedar ahí claritas close the door please could you close the could door coma please. please could you close the door coma please okay mayúscula al principio signo de pregunta al final Please take out the garbage. Will you? Will you please Will you take please out take the garbage? garbage? Will you please take the garbage out? Any of the two options is correct, okay? Ya sea que digan, take out the garbage or take the garbage out, it's correct. What about the next one? Don't see it here. Would you mind? Would you mind, mind sitting. not mind sitting? Not, not sitting. Not sitting. It's Recuerden not que cuando sitting, la pasamos right? a negativo, ocupamos not. Would you mind not sitting mm -hmm. here? Out there, sorry. The next one. Please take the cat out. Can you? Can you please take the cat out? Can you please, you please take, take the, the cat, cat out? out? Very good. Repeat that, please. Could you? Could you repeat that, please? Could you repeat that, please? Or could you? Let's see. Could you repeat that, please? With comma? And without comma. Could you repeat that, please? Siempre. Could you repeat that, comma, please? O lo pueden escribir sin coma. Okay? The next one. The next one is a listening exercise, right? In this listening, you are going to have a short conversation between Stephanie and Richard. Okay? Here, I'm going to play it for you to listen. Let me see if you can do it. Yes. Okay, here you go. Check the correct answers. One. Hey, Stephanie, have you seen Richard recently? I've left him a few voicemails, but he never calls me back. Is he okay? He never calls me back either, but don't worry about him. He bought a new computer last week. So? So, he spends all day and night on his computer. He's become a total geek. Really? He never used to like computers. Well, he does now. He never goes out and has fun anymore. 
two. Hey, Martha, can you come help me? I'm having computer problems. You? But you're such a technophile. You're always surfing the net. Yeah, but I don't know how to do everything. So what's the problem, Barry? Whoa, what are all these photos doing on the table? I'm trying to scan them so I can email them to friends. Oh, scanning is easy. Place the photo here, be sure to put it face down, and then double click on this. That's it? That was easy. Three. Guess what, Eva? I just bought a really cheap plane ticket online. Really? I always go to a travel agent to plan my vacations. Well, you can sometimes get cheaper tickets on the internet. You should browse some websites. You have a computer at home, don't you? Yeah, but I never use it. Why not? What's wrong with it? Nothing. But my roommates are always playing games on it. When I tell them I need to use it, they say they're just going to finish the game, and then it's... Four. How do you like your new computer, Carlos? Actually, Heather, I prefer my old one. Really? Why? There are so many things I can't do. I don't know how to highlight text, drag and drop, or cut and paste. I could do all that on my old computer. And please don't tell me to read the manual. <laughs> Let's take one problem at a time. Okay. I want to highlight those two words. Just use your mouse, like this, and then press this key here. That was easy. Thanks. And that's it, right? So, Richard is a geek. Barry doesn't know how to scan photographs. Photograph. Poor Eva cannot use her computer because her roommates use it a lot. And Heather is showing him I, how to I, highlight the text, right? This was the listening that you have here. In this one, you had another reading. I am not going to stop a lot on the reading because... It is going to take us a little bit of time, but in this one, for all the ones who already finished, how did the teens respond to the neighbor's request? What do you remember from this? Para todos los que ya lo terminaron. They didn't say anything. They didn't say anything. What happens as the tree was being chopped down? The new family continued to, to cut it down. Cut it down. What is the problem with the dogs? They are outside barking all the time. They are barking all the time, right? What is Sally's advice? Let the police, Let the police solve the, the problems. Problem. Let the police solve the problems, right? Don't do it on your own, right? If the dog gets into the soccer field, let the police do it. Did you see the dog yesterday that went into the game? Hubo oh, un, un perrito que se metió a un partido. Did you see it? No. Ah, it was beautiful. Yes, in Alianza. <laughs> in Alianza's game, right? And <laughs> yes, he was yes. playing with the ball. That was so beautiful. <laughs> so in this one, this was a matching exercise, right? Match the phrases with the appropriate information. Before a young man and a woman speak. They might, they might ch chat with each other on the internet. They might chat each other on the internet before they meet for the first time. They usually talk on the telephone. They usually talk on the telephone, right? When they first, they, when, sorry, when they have their first date. They often, they often meet in a public place, place such a coffee, coffee shop. shop. Like a coffee shop, right? And you say like, how are you going to be dressing? Ah, like this and that, they say. And you go different. After they meet for the first time, they, they sometimes, sometimes arrange, arrange another, date. another date. They sometimes arrange another date. Okay, so here you go. And that was the midterm exams, people. Okay, ahí terminan sus exámenes de midterm. So please, if you haven't finished, that's it, right? Eso es lo que tenemos que hacer para poder terminarlos, okay? So, my dear class, that was it, right? About the midterm evaluations, okay? Questions? So far, so good? Preguntas, dudas, comentarios? No yet, right? So if you have already finished with that, that will be it, right? That will be basically all the things that you were supposed to do. 
So let's go back here to our main presentation. People, we have many celebrations around the year in El Salvador. What is your favorite? Mother's Day. Mother's Day. What is your favorite celebration? Christmas. Christmas. In my case, Christmas too. Christmas. I like Holy Week and August vacations because they are long and you can spend time with family and friends. So, in a, about two minutes, okay? Vamos a tener como dos minutitos. Discussion in little groups. What is your favorite celebration and what do you normally do that day? ¿Qué es lo que normalmente hacen ese día? So, you are going to go and talk for two minutes in your group. Solo tienen como dos minutitos en el grupo. Participate and talk. Your favorite celebration and what did you do that day? ¿Qué hacen ese día? Go ahead. Accept my invitation. Favorite celebration and activities that you do. Accept my invitation. Let's go to the groups, please. Even if you are working or busy, accept my invitation. Okay. Thank you. Cesar, le digo mi invitación. Yes. Ceci. Joanna. There you go. Hi. No le llegó la invitación. Let's see. Te voy a pasar otra. There you go. Ahorita. Sí. Pero que me falla el internet ahorita. Oh, ok, ok. Ahorita se les reenvíe. Thank you. Ok. Samuel, accept my invitation, please. <ríe> me regreso a Ivana. <ríe> Ok, voy a intentarlo de nuevo. Ya. Ok. There you go. Me avisa si le llega. Me la trajo de regreso. So, Joanna, what is your favorite celebration? You will be my partner. <laughs> the microphone, sweetie. El micrófono. Fiesta eh, Agostinas. The August parties, right? The August parties is your favorite. What do you normally do on that days? What do you normally do on those uh, days? I visit my parents mm -hmm. and relatives. Uh, go to the beach. Uh, only, only that. Only that. So you go to the beach those days. Yeah. I don't like to go to the beach. It's too busy. I mean, people are there and they are like, oh, it's too crowded in some cases. Mm -hmm. I, I go be I go before, right? I go some days before. Uh, when the rancho, come on. Well, if you if you in some cases it's good to rent a house at the beach. To rent a house at the beach. Yes. I like to do that with my family. To rent right? a house. Yes. Yeah, we do yes. that with all the family. Eh, the, ¿cómo dice? Vienen de los Estados Unidos. When we have visitors from the United States. Uh, visitors when the United States families. Oh, okay. Eh, families. Eh, we we go to the beach. Yeah. Uh, compartir share. and share we go to the and beach share. and share right and share. excellent we go to the beach to share with with family mm -hmm. and friends yes yeah. okay so i am going to bring everyone back thank you for sharing you were my partner 
eh, <ríe> in this night. I will bring okay. everybody. Ya os traigo okay. a todo el mundo de regreso. It's okay. okay. We are going to wait for them. Vamos a esperar a que vengan todos. Teacher. Okay. okay. Good, 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 good. They are coming right now. Welcome back. Welcome back, my dear students. Thank you for sharing. We were working here with Joanna, talking about the different celebrations that we like. And for sure, we were talking about the favorite one. Poor Cesar was like coming here and going back, right? Cesar se me conectaba, se me desconectaba. <laughs> Y volvía y se iba. Good. So, I need two volunteers. What is your favorite celebration and what do you do? Two volunteers. Me teacher. Go ahead, Jenny. Me teacher. In my case, my favorite uh, celebrate is Holy Week because I uh, can go to the church in order to participate for all the activity and that quick. And I spent time, too much time with my family uh, preparing traditional food, as for example, fish and egg. Hey. I love that, <laughs> that kind of food. It's, it's weird because I love it. <laughs> and, <laughs> and as for example, torrejas, because Torreja. it's a food that you uh, can eat in in that um, holiday okay very good this it is very curious that we can prepare traditional food every day but we love yeah. to prepare traditional <laughs> food on a specific days of the year for example in holy week we have all the candies we have mom beans mangoes we have a pumpkin we have so many different types of candies right so but it's good on that specific day, right? So it is it is nice. Also the cover fish, it's a very famous one. The cover fish with egg and with all the other things that they put on it. So there are some people who like it, there are some people who don't, but it is traditions in our country. It's a tradition, right? It is a tradition. Good. Thank you, Jenny. Another volunteer. What is Me your teacher? Yeah, go ahead, Jancy. Um I, uh, for me, uh, this is uh, the cross day celebration is is beautiful uh -huh. because there are there are uh, many fruits and and uh, what do you say? Uh, uh, mm, excuse me, uh, ideas. Ideas, eh, tradiciones antiguas. Okay, there are so there are many ideas and traditions from the past, right? And okay. for sure, to share the fruit from the cross is the best part of that celebration, right? Very good job. Thank you to my two volunteers for the favorite celebration, right? So in this case, we have many celebrations and we also have a special days. In this case, for example, we have. Uh, my birthday, you say like my birthday, that you enjoy it. But why do you enjoy your birthday? And in this case, let me just move this a little bit so we can see it. And it says, my birthday is a day when, and you can do many things. For example, in my case, my birthday is a day when I have surprise parties. I receive many phone calls. Okay, I ate the H here. I visit um, a nice restaurant. I get together with my family. I receive gifts from my family. So my birthday is a day when, and then you do many things that day. Here, exactly as in the example of the birthday, you say, Christmas is a day when I cook turkey with my family, I receive gifts, I share with my family, I dance, right? And all the different activities that you do on your special celebration. Here, this one, it's a little example of the relative clauses 
with the different types of celebrations. Here, for example, I took here a little bit of the celebrations that we can have each of the months. You can have on January, we have New Year's Eve. For example, if you have a birthday in January, you say eh, Marlon's daughter's birthday my sister's birthday, my mother's birthday, you can say, okay? It is also part of a celebration. The three wise men day. Do you know what is that or what that is? The three wise men day? That is a music, right? No, it's on January 6th. Mm. Los Reyes Magos. Exactly like that, right? The Three Wise Men Day. It is on January 6th. On February, we have Valentine's Day, right? We have Valentine's Day. Here we have also on March, we have the Business Administration Day, Holy Week, St. Patrick's Day, and Women's Day. For example, today, it's Women's Day, right? On April, we have the Secretary's Day. And do we have any birthday on April here? Me. Alejandra's birthday. So I will change my example here. Alejandra's birthday, right? We have Alejandra's birthday on April, right? On May, we have Labor Day, the Soldier's Day, and Mother's Day. On June, we have the Father's Day and Teacher's Day. On July, we have Santa Ana's parties, right? Las Julias. On August, we have Salvador del Mundo's Day and we have San Salvador's parties. And for sure, the most beautiful thing of September, besides Independence Day, is your teacher's birthday. <laughs> On Independence Day. Así que no lo olvidan. Si hay... Día de la Independencia, hay cumpleaños de la teacher. So, <laughs> it is the same day. In this one. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I move it here. On October, do we have any birthdays in October? Or any birthdays in September with me? We don't have any other birthday in September? ¿Nadie más cumpleaños en septiembre? No. Solo yo soy hija de la Navidad. Hmm. <laughs> I am product of Christmas. Let's see. October? No birthdays in October? Me teacher. Oh, Edson's birthday <laughs> is in October. Very good. Yes. Okay, Edson. Who else? Uh, what about, uh, well, in October we also have Children's Day, Halloween, and the Columbus Day, que es el Día de la Raza. November, we have All Saints Day, el Día de Todos los Santos, or the Death Day and Thanksgiving. And also and, my birthday. And also Edgar's birthday, okay? I will include you here. Okay. Edgar's birthday. You will be my example for this, for November. And on December, you have Christmas Eve or Christmas Day, right? These are the most common celebrations that we have here. In El Salvador, we have many more. Que el día de la naranja, que el día del no sé qué, que el día del jocote, que el día de la pupusa, que el día de... We celebrate everything here, right? Everything. So we love parties. We love to celebrate. So... La cosa es celebrar, dice. Yeah, and for everything, cake, right? Ah, al niño le salió un diente, pastel. <laughs> <laughs> Al niño se le cayó, pastel. <laughs> so, we celebrate everything. So, we have all the different celebrations and we also have a specific days when they happen, right? In this case, I have some examples. The Chinese New Year, when does it happen? ¿Cuándo sucede esto? ¿Cuándo es el Chinese New Year? January. Or January February. or February. Mm -hmm. What about Valentine's Day? February 14. 14. On February 14. The Children's Day? May 5th. May 5th. And the day May of the death? November 2nd. November 
Second. 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 <laughs> what do people do on the Chinese New Year? Chinese, Chinese people? people celebrate with uh, firecrackers. And lion dances. Lion, lion dances son esas como, no son como marionetas, son como no, unos muñecos enormes que tienen los, los chinos para celebrar. Depending on the year. Okay? Depending on the year and depending on the animal of the year. What about Valentine's? What do people do on Valentine's? People in many countries give chocolate, flowers, or jewelry to the people they love. Very good. Children's Day. Japanese families, Japanese families put up, put color, up color, color streamers, streamers shapes, shapes like, like, fish, like fish in honor, in honor of, their, of their, children. their children. And what about the Day of the Death? Mexican, Mexican families after food to the dead then have a meal in a cemetery. And they have a meal in a cemetery. Okay, so tomorrow we are going to go in deep with the definitions of the celebrations. Okay, así que si tienen una celebración favorita, vayan creando su definición de esa celebración. ¿Qué es lo que hacen ese día? So it's going to be easy for you to be in the class tomorrow. Well, my dear students, have a fantastic night. Remember that we have some pendant things. Please finish them, okay? A los que nos falta enviar el, el comprobante del manual, enviémoslo. A los que nos falta la inscripción, enviémosla. Y a los que nos falta terminar eh, los exámenes, ya los completamos, así que enviémoslo. One, yes? qu qu one question, excuse yep. me. Uh, the attendance. Uh... Ah, I called the attendance when I was sí. checking you the, when I was, cuando los estaba oh, okay. revisando uno por uno. Ahí les okay. tomé asistencia. But, eh, Eduardo José, no vino. Eh, José Daniel, Tampoco, ya no se me conectó. Eh, let's see, Katherine Alejandra. Tampoco. Eh, Miguel Ángel, tampoco se me conectó. Y Raulito de Jesús, tampoco. Ok, cuando les iba pasando el, el, la revisión de, <risa> de plataforma, ahí les pasé lista. Ah, okay. ok, have a wonderful night and I will see you tomorrow. Bye bye. I see you tomorrow. Bye bye. Take care. Bye bye.